This is the great secret that everyone knows except us in the West. Uh, almost any other culture that we go to, from uh, uh, the monasteries in Egypt and Tibet and India and the Bolivia and Peru, the indigenous traditions, little villages in the Andes Mountains, they all know that there is this experience that we can have inside of our bodies that affects our world in some way, and our science simply uh, has not allowed for that historically. So I began to go to these places. I began to go into the monasteries, uh, uh, all the places that I mentioned. And what we begin to understand is that this is the place where science got it wrong. There are two places, two assumptions. First one is that the space we believe is empty is not really so empty. It's, it's full of a, of a living essence, of a living material that we're only beginning to understand, number one. And number two, the fact, and it is a fact now, that we may have experiences inside of our bodies that influence the world beyond our bodies through the conduit of what's in this space. So it was in going into the monasteries and the nunneries and speaking with the indigenous people looking at them eye to eye, heart to heart, God to God, and I could say to these people, when you just perform that miracle, when you just perform that miraculous healing, what is it that you did inside of your body to make that happen? And if I didn't understand what they told me, I'd ask them again and again and again through the translators until I understood that they were creating an experience, producing an effect inside of their bodies that my science never told me it was possible or, or existed. And so it was that path that allowed me to flesh out the missing pieces that uh, we're only beginning to understand today, marrying the best science of our time with the wisdom, 5,000 years of wisdom of, of our past, uh, into a greater understanding. And that understanding it brings us back to where, where we're only now beginning to understand that there is something that we can do in our lives that influence not only the, the physical body, uh, ours and, and those of other people around us, but, but literally influence the physical reality of our world. And that changes everything. It changes everything that we in the West believe about ourselves. So as a scientist, I've also come to understand this is a very different way for many people to think about themselves and their world. And this is not something that people typically talk about in a, a, a technical organization. They don't wake up in the morning and say, what kinds of feelings, what kinds of dreams, what kinds of healings did you have over the weekend? And they're talking about who won the football game and who won the lotteries. This is where it brings us uh, the relevance in our lives because we all are having experiences every day, whether we are consciously aware of it or not, those experiences are physically affecting our bodies and our world. The truth is hidden in plain sight, and this is how they hide everything. If you are looking for the knowledge that has been hidden from us, that explains how actually powerful you are. If you want to know what you are and where you are, this ebook will literally unveil that for you. And ye shall know the truth, and truth shall set you free.